anime games have become increasingly popular over the years, captivating fans with their visually stunning graphics, intricate storylines, and engaging gameplay. This genre has carved out a unique space in the world of gaming and is so hot right now that it's not even surprising to see more and more people getting into it. The only problem though is there's so many options when looking for the best anime games for your phone, so in this video, I've rounded up some of the most popular and best games for mobile that you can play in 2023. Oh, and don't forget to hit that like and subscribe buttons to get updated on all kinds of games for Android and iOS. Let's get started. Starting off at number 10, we have Volzerk. Volzerk is an action-adventure game with beautiful 3D visuals and engaging storyline. In the game, you will take the role of a young girl called Fina and embark on a journey to uncover multiple mysteries taking place on an island. After the disappearance of the guardian Volzerk, the monsters have to survive an extinction that's looking more and more likely. The controls are quite different from your usual open-world anime games on mobile. You will still have the classic joystick for moving your character, but you won't have the usual skill bar. Instead, you will just have to tap and swipe the right side of the screen to utilize your skills. Volzerk will definitely immerse you in a magical world in which tons of monsters and magical beings come together. This game is definitely worth your time. Next up at number 9, we have Oath of Peak. Oath of Peak is a new mobile MMORPG developed by Studio ROC Game taking the player into a world inspired by Chinese mythology with fast-paced action combat and a lot of customization for the characters. The game feels like a fairly typical Chinese action RPG that have popped up ever since Genshin Impact got so popular. But unlike a lot of those games, this one has actually been localized into English. This isn't necessarily a bad thing though as the game is pretty much fun in terms of combat but of course that depends on one's preference and opinion. Opinion. Though a lot of players don't like the cryptocurrency integration in this game, Oath of Peak has the potential to be a good MMORPG. The foundations are there with solid exploration and customization. Moving on to number 8, we have Hashtag Me 3D Avatar Meet and Play. This is a social MMORPG that allows players to play whatever they want. The game is set in a universe called Estrella, which allows players to participate in an exciting adventure with an engaging and beautiful storyline. There are lots of adventurous things waiting and a lot of quests to complete while battling monsters. Hashtag Me 3D Avatar Meet and Play is a colorful and fun MMORPG with various activities to do. You will also engage with players and NPCs as the game's story involves you personally. This MMORPG is pretty good, although a lot of players complain about the optimization, especially for low-end devices. At number 7, we have Sword Art Online Variant Showdown. Sword Art Online Variant Showdown is a free RPG game released by Bandai Namco to celebrate the 10th year anniversary of the Sword Art Online anime series. It's basically set in the same universe as the original anime and is one of the many audiovisual productions based on the anime franchise. The game features an original storyline that allows players to explore the world of Sword Art Online, engage in battles, and experience new adventures. The game follows up a story of Kirito, who by chance learned the existence of a new game called Cross Edge, a game designed by a high school student that hides a dangerous adventure. Rumor has it that in Cross Edge, a player appears at unexpected moments that can take out other players and wipe out their memories. The mystery catches Kirito's attention so he decided to investigate what's going on. Sword Art Online Variant Showdown is definitely a fun and engaging game for those who are fans of gacha anime game genre. Coming in at number 6, we have Summoner's War Chronicles. Summoner's War Chronicles is an MMORPG spin-off of the already popular mobile title called Summoner's War Sky Arena, which is a gacha game. When this series began more than 8 years ago, it was the start of the mobile phenomenon. Now, with Summoner's War Chronicles, the series has evolved into a grand adventure that stacks right up with just about any other anime games have to offer. The production value is amazing, it's an open world game with fantastic anime style cutscenes, solid voice acting, and engaging story that expands on the established universe. While the free-to-play game comes with microtransactions, you're actually able to earn quite a lot of progress at a steady pace even without spending money. Next up in number 5, we have Nino Kuni Crossworld. 
Nino Kuni Cross World is an MMORPG in which you take the role of a character who dives into a virtual world whose native inhabitants have no idea about the real reality. It basically follows up an isekai type of story. The story is reasonably interesting and engaging and there are five different classes, each with its own special features, mage, swordsman, engineer, destroyer, or rogue. The gameplay is similar to other persistent world RPGs. You will be able to move freely in a 3D settings while performing all kinds of quests. Once you pass the tutorial, you can explore the universe of Nino Kuni at your free will, hunt enemies, obtain resources, explore dungeons, join a guild, and create your own clan. Moving on to number 4, we have Tower of Fantasy. Terror of Fantasy is a 3D MMORPG where the player controls a customizable character avatar who interacts with non-player characters and other entities and collect items as they travel around the open virtual world. The game follows up a post-apocalyptic story of salvation and destruction by combining interesting characters, high freedom world exploration, and chaotic sci-fi art style with diversity of scenarios, interactive puzzle components, and dynamic combat feel. If you're looking for an anime MMORPG with serious storyline and fast combat, Tower of Fantasy might be for you. At number 3, we have Honkai Impact 3rd. Honkai Impact 3rd is a free-to-play 3D action role-playing game developed and published by miHoYo, and later ported to Microsoft Windows. It is a spiritual successor to Hokai Gakuen 2, using many characters from previous title in separate story. The game takes place on an alternative version of Earth plagued by Honkai, a mysterious force that sends alien-like monsters to Earth. This force is capable of turning humans into godlike individuals, who often become corrupted by their powers. Honkai Impact 3rd's expansive story is very intriguing, emotional, and gripping, and it's definitely one of the most attractive parts of the game. And the combat is absolutely one of the best on mobile, not to mention the character development is so impressive that it could make its player emotional. Down to number 2, we have Punishing Grey Raven. <laughs> Punishing Grey Raven is an ARPG that puts you in control of an elite squadron in a battle against all different kinds of robots. The combat is absolutely one of the best, and this is the only gacha game that has skill expression of the player. Punishing Grey Raven is definitely one of the best and most polished gacha games out there. It's a highly engaging game with one of the best storylines I've ever encountered so far. Every character plays differently, and the music is a banger. A massive banger. If you haven't played Punishing Craven yet and you like anime action games overall, you should definitely give it a shot. And finally at number 1, we have Genshin Impact. Genshin Impact is a free-to-play action role-playing game with gacha mechanics. You can play cross-platform on PlayStation 4 or 5, PC, Android, and iOS. You'll explore a world of Teyvat as either Ether or Lumen, twins who are known as travelers. Pairing up with other characters you'll meet on your journey, you'll face a range of enemies and uncover some intriguing secrets. There's a story-based quest chain to follow filled with lore about the world. This is alongside character-specific quests, daily tasks, dungeons, and more. Genshin Impact is a very extensive game and the volume of content you can access for free is absolutely staggering. There are lots of regions to explore, numerous quests to complete, and characters to collect and level. And you can spend hours and hours in-game without even spending a penny. And that wraps it up for the top 10 best anime games for mobile to play in 2023 part 1. There will obviously be part 2 so stay tuned, don't forget to like the video, and subscribe to the channel. As always, this has been Gaming at Max and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.